The Krishnanagar Rajbari is scattered all around. It looks like ruins, but these are functional. So this is the first building I came to. Here is a jolsa. 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 हैं ये खाने समस्त माने बीचार आचा बीचार आचा समस्त बिचु ये गुलती होते और वो ही जो राजवाड़ी देख चोपड़े रानी मजा को नाचते हैं जब को महानानी ज्योतिमुई जो बालिका विद्यालय दिया आज ना महानानी ज्योतिमुई जब को ये खाने आस्ते हैं तो आपको उन्हें एक ता लाल निशान पता का ये होते तो आपको � एक है ना स्कूल टाके दान करे चिलो माने स्कूल पार्पा शेटा के दान करे चिलो एक जायगा टाके आर आमादे रे ये यार टेक थोड़ी दिया हुए थे एक है ना हमरा कोई ना कोई आईसीडीएस जब बच्चा दे शिशु विकास पुकार पे एक है ना स्कूल टाको ली स्कूले बच्चे दे खान हाय रामला वरना करा ये जगह तामरा को राजबारी और द किंग्स पैलेस हैज अ लॉन्ग ट्रेडिशन इन बंगाल्स हिस्ट्री। हियर इन नोदिया डिस्ट्रिक्ट कृष्णनगर राजबारी वाज बिल्ड ड्यूरिंग द रेन ऑफ राजा कृष्णचंद्रो इन बिटवीन 1728 एंड 1782। द पैलेस इज मोर देन 300 इयर्स ओल्ड। इट्स ड्य� and despite his cunning footsteps throughout history, he was a great lover of art, literature, music and architecture. And this is his Rajbari, the window to his court. And the origin of the famous Bengali tales of Krishnachandra and Gopal Bhar. Rajbari was born in अकुन रानी माँ जे नोटुन रानी माँ कुन ऐसे चेंज की पौधों तीन चेंज जानी ना उन्हीं ना की शॉप घिरे देवे एक तो छागुल गोड़ी पंचे तो खाने चल गए ना सो यू आर ओनली अलाउड टू एंटर द राजबारी ड्यूरिंग दुर्गा पूजा एंड जगदार्थी पूजा सो देर आर थ्री फोर स्ट्रक्चर्स ऑल अराउंड one of them, the first one is now a school and there are some ruins which are under construction and then there is the main complex. I'm just stupefied by the enormous structure and I was not expecting this in Krishnanagar. So when I first entered the church and I stole the first glimpse of the church from the street, my jaws dropped because I was not at all expecting an architecture like this in Krishnanagar. It's just beautiful. So this is the Roman Catholic Church and there is a Protestant church just in opposite. The 19th century architecture was destroyed in an earthquake, but rebuilt in 1899. Neither Gothic, Neoclassical or Victorian, it's a blend of different styles of architecture. The church has sculptures of Jesus from his birth to the crucifixion. With 27 oil paintings, wooden sculptures by Italian artists, frescoes, it is still considered to be one of the most beautiful churches in Bengal.
and we all know why Krishnanagar is so famous because of its clay dolls. So you can find Martir Putul at Ghurni, which is only three kilometers away from the main city of Krishnanagar, and there there is a Putul Potti, uh, the hub actually where the artisans live and they make their clay dolls. This is a 250-300 year old tradition of Krishnanagar. These dolls capture the everyday life, work, characters like basket makers, farmers, baul and more extensive work on deities and the figures of Bengal. The doll makers were already settled in Ghurni. It was the initiated support of King Krishnachandra that flourished it till today. It is said that only 100 craftsmen are present in Krishnanagar now and only 15 to 20 of them are well to do. The rest live off very low income as the craft is slowly dying. <laughs> 